And we begin tonight with breaking news on a lawsuit filed against Health Now New York, the parent company of Blue Cross Blue Shield of Western New York. Good evening, I'm Mary Alice Demler. And hello again, I'm Scott Levin. Health Now is facing a whistleblower lawsuit now alleging the company overcharged school districts and some government agencies by nearly $100 million. Two on your side's Kelly Dudzik has been looking through the lawsuit. She joins us now from the newsroom. Kelly, what do we know? Well, Scott and Mary Ellis, the lawsuit filed in 2016 and amended and unsealed today accuses the parent company of Blue Cross Blue Shield of Western New York Health Now of illegally inflating health care costs and ripping off people who use that insurance and the government agencies that fund certain plans. Our partners at Buffalo Business First were first today to report this news. Here's a breakdown of what I've found out so far. Since 1998 and through 2013, the lawsuit alleges Health, health Now was overcharging customers even though it had access to a computer program that was supposed to make sure overpayments did not happen. When the whistleblower, who was an auditor at the company, brought this up to her higher ups, the lawsuit alleges they told her to drop the issue. According to the lawsuit in 2013 alone, Health Now overcharged nearly $52 million. In 2014, after the whistleblower says the issue was discovered, the lawsuit says Health Now continued to overcharge by about $33 million. When contacted this evening, Health Now said it just received the complaint. Its lawyers are still reviewing it and from its investigation found no evidence of any significant cost to any state or federal health care program resulting from Health Now's policies. I'm still looking through the lawsuit too and I'll bring you much more information tonight at 10 on Fox and at 11 right here on Channel 2. Kelly Dudzik, Channel 2 News.